we got the holy moly guacamole. More water in there. We got one of the most epic unboxings to date. Epic coral added to this tank from LAX Aquarium. Now, if you guys like this type of content, consider hitting the subscribe button and notification bell because my analytics are showing that most of my viewers aren't subscribed. So if you guys can hit that sub button, that would be absolutely awesome. Let's jump into the video. So this box, you guys, has got the Lakers trophy in it. Not the actual trophy, but this coral is like the Lakers trophy. Oh my goodness. And then we got some baller pieces here. These guys got to go get temp acclimated. And this thing, they call it the guacamole. Holy moly guacamole. Oh man, this is going to be such an epic unboxing with some sick corals. Being, healthy corals, sick being awesome. And this is gonna be so incredibly cool. More water in there ASAP. Here is number two. Wait, come on. They look very similar, which is okay. Totally fine with me. <laughs> oh, this is the Lakers trophy right here. This is the championship trophy right here oh my goodness oh man go go there we go get some of this water in there quick there we go then we'll get this guy back there okay, let's go ahead and Pull this off. That was just to protect this thing. Because, I mean, this thing is insane. And you don't want it to get messed up. There we go. There we go. As you can see, that is definitely a wall hammer coral. We got the holy moly guacamole. Boom. All right, we're gonna do what we do. Let this double in volume. Cut the rubber band off. Now just pull this guy out. Set it in place. We're gonna go and shut the drip off. Now what we gotta do is get the dip in here. And I'm gonna do something a little bit different than normal. Now this is a two gallon bucket, so I'm going to assume we got a gallon in here. So you got the dip and it asks for 30 drops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. And I'll go a couple extra just in case it's a little bit more. Go ahead and get the baster put back together. I'm just gonna go and shake it. There we go. And then dog going crazy in the background. I gotta go check what's going on. All right, let's find out what's going on here. Hey, what were you barking at out there? Nothing over there? Huh? All right. Well, I guess it was nothing. Sometimes they just like to bark. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start off with this hammer and, you know, learning from my mistakes, not to pull it off of this right now, let it settle in, 
then we can get it off this in a couple of weeks. Um, just don't, I don't want to risk any chance of this guy getting stressed out for no reason at all. So I'm going to inspect the skeleton, make sure it does look okay. And just a light on the polyps, just really light, just in case anything. We'll go ahead and go with the holy moly guacamole. And again, I'm not gonna pull it off the plug this time because I really have messed up stuff in the past because these things are sensitive uh, as far as sometimes the skeleton is just not strong enough and it'll break. Um, and I just, I cannot have that happen again. This is a big piece, wow. Here is the holy mole guacamole. Wow, that thing is insane, holy moly. <laughs> I wonder why they call it the holy moly guacamole. That piece. And we got that piece. I'm gonna move this guy a little further back. So we could get those acans there. And maybe we could do we could do this here. Get that guy there. So here are the four pieces we got in today that are settling in, obviously. You know, it's going to be a little bit of time for them to, you know, get all set. Um, let's go ahead and we're going to pull the viewing glass out. So we got two A-cans, that holy moly guacamole, and this is the Lakers trophy. We'll go over them all once they open up. Let's check out the new corals. Here is the Lakers trophy the championship trophy look at that thing lakers hammer purple and gold what in the world this is so awesome look at that incredible then we got this a can with red and kind of like a tealish green and then we got the other a can with the blue on it and the red and then the holy moly guacamole there is a can number one. Look at that beauty. A can number two. Here's the holy moly guacamole. It's like a frog spawn, octo spawn. So it's it's green with yellow and slash orange. Look more yellow to me. And then the green center. Awesome. And the Lakers hammer. Look at that. Moon c shape for champions <laughs> just look at that thing purple and gold i wanted to show you guys the lakers hammer look at how great this thing is looking it has had some time to settle on in you got that purple you got some of that gold look at that beautiful coral doing super awesome and the holy moly guacamole is doing well, and so are the A-cans. All right, here's the A-cans. Wanted to get you another up-close shot of these guys. As you can see, they're doing super good, super well. This one especially is really fluffing out nicely. Then we come on over here, look at the holy moly guacamole. Doing great. Look at the Lakers hammer. You got the gold and you got that purple. What a stunning piece. LAX Aquarium knocked it out of the park. All I've got to say is that Lakers hammer is just something else. Huge Lakers fan. Been one for many, many, many years from when the first three-peat was back in 2000, 2001, 2002. So I lived through all those down years. And then when Kobe had his back-to-back uh, -back with Powell, that was awesome. And then all these downtimes until now. So um, been a Laker fan for years, ups and downs, all that good stuff. So that Lakers hammer 
that Lakers trophy is an epic piece to get into my collection. So excited about that. If you guys like this type of content, consider hitting the subscribe button and notification bell because the analytics are showing that most of my viewers aren't subscribed. So it'd be awesome if you guys can. Let me know what you think of the corals in that comment section down below. I hope to see you guys on the next one. We got a lot coming. Stay tank.